Hello Geminis. So uh, this is the weekly reading I have for you guys. So I'm going to start from today until the 12th. Okay. Um, so I'm going to start with the tarot first. So universe, what's the current energy between Geminis and the person that's on Gemini mind for July the 5th to the 12th, 2021? Okay, Ten of Swords. Okay, I feel like you guys are done with somebody. Okay, you're done waiting. I'm going to see what that's about. Okay, so if you guys have been single for a long time, I feel like you're done waiting. I feel like you guys are going to put yourself out more. Okay, Universe, the person that's on Gemini in mind, what would, they, what would they like to say to Gemini? Four of Cups. Okay, they would like to say that they feel rejected by you. So this person is trying to get your attention or try to talk to you, but... You guys are done with them. Universal person that's on Gemini mind. Why are they keeping hidden? Ace of Cups. Okay, so I feel like this person still having emotions for you. Probably this is someone who didn't never really show their emotions for you. Another um, message I'm getting is that they do have someone else. Okay, this is not someone from their past or someone that they were dealing with at the same time um, when it was with you. Um, this could be someone new. Universe, the person that's on Gemini mind. How do they feel about Gemini for Nine of Pentacles? Hmm. Interesting. So they feel rejected by you, but how they feel is like independent or they feel like this is you. Like they feel like you're independent from this. You don't really care that much. Okay. I'm going to see what else I'm getting. Universe, the person that's on Gemini mind, what is their true feelings for Gemini? Eight of Cups. So they feel like you are done with them. Okay. So I feel like this is someone who was keep trying to reconcile with you. You don't want them. Okay. Now they get in the message. that like You don't want them. And that's why I see here what they keep in hidden is that they are talking to someone new or dealing with somebody new. Okay. So you see, universe, the person that's on Gemini mind, what intentions do they have with Gemini? The Hierophant, King of Wands, Nine of Pentacles. So, yeah, this person is trying to let it be known that they're, see, this person is p petty and filling away um, because I feel like this is someone who always trying to be with you, okay? Probably this is a crush. You always, like, friend zone them. They're trying to make you feel away. They're trying to make you feel away, uh, make you feel like, oh, they have moved on. This could also be someone who was a player in and out your life, and they were trying to reconcile with you plenty of times and you keep on saying no now they want to show you that they have moved on but you see at the actions just look at the actions universe the person that's on gemini mind what actions would they take with gemini six of wands okay yeah so i feel like this person is going to talk about if they were to speak to you again i feel like they're going to talk about how things are looking good for them okay how especially probably with career and work um they might try to show you that they're doing better now um this person yeah that's what i'm seeing so i feel like they're trying to do anything to get your attention and part of that plan is to show you that they have moved on too okay universe clarify the six of wands the three of wands okay universe clarify the three of wands yeah this person's looking for a reaction gemini they are <laughs> the five of wands Okay, which is fighting conflict. They want to see if you're going to get jealous with the devil card being there. Okay, that's what I'm seeing. But a lot of you guys are not because you have moved on as well. It just took some time for them to start to move on. And to be honest, they haven't emotionally moved on. They haven't. I feel like they're trying to. But if you're trying to get attention from an ex, it shows that you haven't moved on. So they're going to try to do whatever to get your attention. Okay. Yes, they might deal. They might be dealing with somebody new, but I feel like they still kind of stuck on you somehow, somewhat. Okay. Some, somehow, somehow. Okay. <laughs> um, the signs. This person could be Earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Also, there's Leo here. There's Scorpio. Yeah, there's Leo, Scorpio, and Cancer. So let's look at the new deck. Okay, so
All right, universe, give me a four card spread. What's going to happen in Gemini Love Life for July the 5th to the 12th, 2021? So there is lover, vampire, guide, and engineer, okay? So engineer is all about, like, trying to... Uh, it's kind of like the magician energy. is like trying to mitigate um, through functions to, um, to build something, right? So I feel like this person is trying to figure out a way to make you feel away. <laughs> okay. They're trying to do that. They're trying to see if you're going to be jealous. Okay. Cause they feel hurt that you have moved on. So they try to feel like if you, like they're trying to make you feel the way that they feel before. Okay. So let's look at the other deck. Oh my. So, universe, give me a four card spread. What's going to happen in Gemini's love life for July the 5th to the 12th? You got the seat. Universe, give me two more cards. I mean, three more. Yeah, two more cards. Success. Universe, give me two more cards. What's going to happen? So, we have complicated and choices. Okay. So, yeah, they may have other options. Like I, was, like I was saying, they have, like, a newer love interest. However, I feel like this person is still stuck on you, okay? They still watch you with the vision card being here. But a lot of you guys success, successfully moving, move on from this person, okay? But I feel like they're lying to themselves because it's like they're trying to prove a point like they have moved on, but they're not because they're still worrying about you and how you're going to react, okay? So let's look. At the Capra Dog, the Island of Time. Okay. So, Universe, give me a four card spread. What's going to happen in Gemini's Love Life of July the 5th to the 12th, 2021? So, there is high honor. I feel like you guys are going to be classy with it. You're not going to really care. <laughs> Concern. They're trying to see if you care, but you don't. <laughs> Most of you guys don't. Um, occupation. Some of you guys work together. Universe, give me one more card. And house. Gender energy, unexpected income. So, I feel like this is also pertaining to general. Um, some of you guys are working to um, get a new home. Okay, you're saving. You're working a lot. Um, concern. Let me clarify the concern. What that's about. For general. Universe, clarify concern. Mature woman. I feel like your parents is worried about you for some reason. I don't know why. They might feel like you work too much. Universe clarify mature woman. Message. Yeah, this is your family. Parents. Your parents is worried about you. Okay, and it could be relating to this um, person, this false person. So even if, you, if one of your parents or both of your parents pass away, I feel like... Um, they have been worried about what's going on in your life currently. The universe is, like, trying to say, like, and your parents is trying to say, like, do stuff that's not going to be more stressful, okay? Like, don't be with people that's going to stress you out more. So, let's see. Okay, so universe, give me a three card spread. What messages do you have for Gemini for July the fifth to the fifteenth? I mean, to the to the twelfth, twenty twenty one. Universe, what messages do you have for Gemini? Heart with the key. Universe, give me two more cards. Self indulgence. Universe, give me one more card. And talking. Okay, so I feel like, yeah, you guys are focusing on yourself. Also, again, for those who are trying to buy a new home, okay, or just move out, you were trying to say, like, just budget wisely. Don't, like, don't, don't spend too much, okay? Okay, yep, yeah, don't spend too much. 
So, cassette. Odds and thinking, conditioning, replaying events over your head. Welcoming love, meeting the one, opening your heart, getting together perfect. To focus on self, self work, self, um, time to heal, shadow work, and self appreciation. Interested, conversing more, awaited um, messages, arrive, text, call, email, hovering. So, yes, look here. Universe, give me a four card spread. Okay, attraction. Universe, give me three cards. Chemistry. Passion. Oh, I feel like you're going to be meeting someone that lit your fire. Okay. It's probably been a while, but you're going to really connect with this person. Getting together. Yep. Getting to know each other. Love yourself first. Okay. So you were trying to say, remember all the lessons that you experienced before with past connections. Okay. But I do see you going to be connecting with somebody that match your fly. Okay. This is someone who have the same type of energy as you so it could be another gemini but it's really good times fun times so let's look here okay let's look here look at this ace of cups gonna show its face yeah you got new love coming okay this could be a soulmate with a destiny you want to show itself a new beginning yeah a new, a new person it could be an aries pisces a pisces aries class person so, universe, give me a four card spread. What messages? Okay. So, we have financial material changes, heart chakra, temptation, the devil. Okay. We got authority, suffering, and silence, nine of swords. I mean, nine of swords or eight of swords? Yeah, nine of swords. Truth, wisdom, obstacle, and challenges, light, sacral chakra. Okay. So, someone is trying to control you. Okay, they still want to be a factor in your life, <laughs> but you guys don't care about them anymore. Okay. Okay, let's look at the angel answers. Let me go to the oracles. Okay, so universe, give me a four card spread. What messages do you have for Gemini? Okay, so not the right time romance, okay? And then also the situation improved. I feel like with not with the, not with the right time, it's more like the universe have more important things for you to do, okay, when it comes to relationship. So if your relationship have been like effed up, it's, it's designed like that on purpose. The universe wants you to focus on something else, okay? And I feel like once you do and you head to that direction, you put your all in that direction, that's when your love life is going to improve because you're going to track better, okay? Universe, give me one more card. Let go, okay? A year from now, within the next few weeks. So I feel like, yeah, I feel like a lot of you guys are moving on. The universe is trying to say continue to move on. Everything is going to come into full circle. It's probably faster than what you think, okay? Because I got within the next few weeks. And some of you guys are just going to take a little while. But you're gonna, you guys are going to have a full circle moment, okay? Reconsider. I feel like you guys are just moving on. So let's look at the oracle. Okay. Okay, right, universe, give me a four card spread. What messages do you have for Gemini for July? Clear vision, you're right. The sun card. Okay. A lot of Leo reference. So Leo, um, Leo season is going to be very great for you. The emperor, okay. And then also have no fear in reverse. I feel like, yeah, you're going to be more open to love, okay, and meeting people soon. If you have, Gemini's are not like that. You guys are mutable signs. You guys love to be around people. But if you have not been feeling yourself that much, I feel like in July, like um, late July, like August, Leo season is going to be bomb season for you guys, Okay. You're going to be back in your energy, okay? I feel like you are going to spark interest in someone who can do a lot for you, okay? With the emperor being there, universe. Some of you guys going to connect with a new Aries. This person have Aries in there. Venus, moon, rising, okay? This is, yeah, this is someone who's single, which is good, okay? This is someone who's different than your rest, okay? And that's what I'm seeing. Could be a Scorpio as well. Leo, we got Taurus here because Uncle X is a Taurus. Um, what's it, Taurus? So it could be any of those signs. 
or they have that in their placement. But yeah, that's what I'm seeing. So I'm seeing you guys are going to get back to you. Um, your ex is trying to get any attention from you, <laughs> do anything to have your attention. But yeah, you guys are moving on. So that's the reading that I got for you, Gemini. Thank you guys for watching my video and subscribing. If this video resonates, you can definitely book a personal read with me at queenforthetarot at gmail.com.